Hello, another warm welcome to Trinity Academy Cathedral. I'm Mr. Pickering, and I'm responsible for transition in Key Stage 3 progress. Back in September, I went to lots of primary schools to tell students about the opportunities that they will have with us at Cathedral. And I'm really excited to see that you now have a place with us. I just wanted to tell you a bit about what my role entails and how the initiatives that I set up will really drive your uh, children forwards while they're with us at Cathedral. We run lots and lots of initiatives throughout Key Stage 3, and these are designed to really motivate students but reward students for their brilliance. They are also designed to give students lots and lots of opportunities so that they really holistically develop with us, and it's not all about their academic achievements. So firstly, I wanted to talk a bit about things that are going to help the transition. Obviously, we've not had our usual transition processes in place this year. We had to cancel our transition day based on the government guidance. And so I wanted to reassure you that your children will still have a very rich um, transition program. Firstly, we have 134 students coming to our summer school. And I want to also reassure parents, if you're child is not coming to summer school, they won't be disadvantaged, but the summer school is going to be a really exciting opportunity for students to meet teachers, have a little bit of a taster of some lessons, and get used to the way the um, academy's routines and expectations work. So we're really exciting to be hosted that, hosting that this year. The Cathedral Way is what all students are going to do over their first four days at the academy. They're going to be taking part in lots of dis different sessions about finding out about our routines, our expectations, our core values, uh, empathy, respect, responsibility um, and honesty alongside really looking at motivation, um, nutrition, sleep patterns and making sure that they're in the best possible mindset and the, have the best possible approach to life at Cathedral. And so they also understand what we expect on a day to day basis. Masters of Recall next. So this is our homework program, but it's also um, a program that really looks at developing students' knowledge across the curriculum, but also gives them the skills for academic success. So they get something called a knowledge organizer for nine of their subjects. Each week, they'll be given some knowledge from that knowledge organizer to learn at home. So they will be get asked to use one of our academy's retrieval methods, which will really help them develop how to revise ready for when they get into the latter years at the academy. They will be expected to do some homework on that every single week. And if students don't do the homework, then they will get a detention. But if we feel that students are struggling with that homework, struggling with the retrieval practice, then we will put interventions into place. So it's a very, very supportive mechanism. Um, and I'm sure all our students are going to do their homework when they come to us. Involve. Um, it's probably self-explanatory once I tell you what Involve is, but it's being involved with lots of our extracurricular clubs. Each year we run about 60 different clubs. So it's not just about sport. We have clubs running across the academy from art and design, gardening, and then using the produce to cook with, performing arts, debate club, um, lots and lots of sports as well alongside it. So a, a really exciting mix and something there for every student to enjoy. The other great thing is that if there's not a club being run that uh, students have an interest in, and there's a group of them that would like to do it, we help and support students set up their own club so that it can run. Uh, an example of this was that we did Anime Club uh, a couple of years ago because there was a real interest in doing that. So maybe you could start and run one of our new clubs for next year. We have a Year 7 Residential. Uh, a really exciting opportunity that all of Year 7 are invited to at the end of the year, where they get to go away for the weekend and do lots of outdoor activities. So the classic things like raft building, uh, mountaineering, abseiling, but also because they're um, in Year 7, they're at an age where they can also take part in quad biking as well. So lots of excitement um, will be built around the Year 7 residential at the end of the year. We have the Cathedral Odyssey that students are really challenged with as soon as they join the academy. So it's based on um, 
the Odyssey and Odysseus' journey home, where it took him 10 years. He had lots of challenges to overcome. And because we felt that our year sevens are just starting on a new journey themselves, we're going to give them 18 challenges to complete throughout the year. So those challenges start with great attendance, getting lots of achievement points, going to read in lots of books, uh, participating in raising money for charity, participating in our uh, campaign weeks at the academy. So lots and lots of varied um, things that we want students to get involved with. And again, going back to that holistic development, it's not all about their progress in their subject areas. Although that is very important, we want our students to come out rounded individuals so that they're ready for life after cathedral. Once they move past the uh, year seven, they will then be enrolled onto our graduation scheme. So they have two years and at the end of year nine, you can see a picture down there of our students graduating ahead of starting their GCSEs. And again, that's built upon some criteria that they've got to uh, work towards, but it also gives us that opportunity to really start talking about life after cathedral, getting them to think about what careers they'd like to do, what education they need to access those careers. And it's a really good opportunity for us to have those conversations but also for us to celebrate with families about the um, hard work and achievements of students over the first few years at the academy we want to really reassure you that the academy isn't all about year 11 results and that as soon as your child steps in the door they need to be making the most of all the opportunities we give them because they will become very well-rounded individuals if they do so I'm really excited to meet in your children in September and I hope to meet you soon after that. Thank you.